Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the problem 75 in chapter 10. In this chapter, we talk about rotational motion. In this system, you can see initially there is a uh, ball, right? It is at position A. And then it uh, does the motion, reaches to position B. We need to find its speed when it reaches to the lowest point, the B. So for this one, of course, we consider it. Normally, we will consider the energy is conserved, agree? Because only the gravity does the work, right? So first of all, we consider the initial energy. So initial energy, we take this point, the point B, as a reference point. So the position at the A is mg r naught. See, the distance from the A to the reference point r naught, right? And then, when it reaches to position B, we consider its energy. There, we must consider the potential energy for B, because you can see the center of mass for this ball with the reference point is a distance. This distance called R0, small R0. And then we consider the linear kinetic energy for B and the rotational energy for the object B, right? So in this one, first thing, the relationship between the linear velocity and angular velocity for B is in this function. And also, we can find the I, momentum of erasure for this ball very easily on our test book. Now we input the omega and the I inside, so the function can be simplified as this one. When you simplify this function, you can solve the velocity VB in this function, right? Then everything is done. Thank you.